Ryan. Is that it for the questions? Yes. Danny? Hi! Hi. How are you? I'm good. I'm excited to be here. Good. Tell me a little bit about coming to Portland and what you're expecting of, of your time here and your season. Yeah, uh, Portland's always been a place that I've wanted to play since I got drafted in the NWSL. It's been somewhere that I've wanted to be, so I'm um, an incredible fan base here. I'm very excited to play for the city of Portland and represent the Thorns. Um, also some incredible teammates that I get to play alongside. So yeah, my expectations are high. I want to win trophies here, so I'm really excited to get started. What's the difference between playing here and playing in Europe? I think the gap's closed a lot. Um, I followed the league as I've as I've been over there, and it's definitely grown a ton since I since I left. Um, I think the game here is becoming more tactical than it used to be, and I would say that was probably the biggest difference when I left. Um, but the game's coming a long way all over the world uh, in our sport, so it's great to see the league uh, have grown as it has. And I hope to bring my experience in England over here and and bring some of that knowledge with me. Why did you decide to come back to the United States or to? or Canada, you know, yeah, North America. Um, a few different reasons. I think um, my time organically in England just kind of came to an end and I was ready for a change. I had some good options in Europe, but I think, you know, made a big list of pros and cons about, about everywhere. And, and this just seemed like the perfect situation for me. Uh, I think it fits where I'm at in my career. I've always wanted to come back to the league and um, I don't think I, I achieved what I wanted to when I was here the last time. So I want to do that right and um, just really enjoy my time here. So it's a, a city that any player would want to play in. So I'm really uh, grateful to be here. You just touched on it there at the end, but what was it about Portland that checked more of those boxes that you mentioned and having options to play you know, all over the world? Yeah, uh, it's a top, top club, I think. It stacks up against the best in the world. It's definitely, in my opinion, the best in the NWSL. A great foundation from the beginning of when the league started to now. Uh, and since I've been in for the few days that I have, uh, it's incredibly professional the way that everything is done, uh, from the staff to the players to everyday operations. And I've only been here, you know, for this is my first day. So I'm already incredibly impressed. And uh, I just wish that, that my whole decision continues to be validated and I'm really excited to get started so uh, and again like I said it's an attractive place to play as a player in front of 18 to 20,000 fans hopefully more now with the bigger stadium um, so I'm really excited to experience that. You have a long standing relationship with a lot of people in this franchise and regional this year. Talk about that the influence of Canada in this, in this franchise. Yeah, everyone says this is going to turn into the Canadian national team B, uh, which, you know, that's fine with me. But I think it's incredible that the talents of Karina and Rian and obviously Christine are starting to be shown on, you know, the professional stage. And Rian was an incredible player, an incredible teammate. And I was uh, able to experience her as a coach for a few years with the national team. And she's 100% equipped for, for a team like this at this level. So I'm really excited to play underneath her. And, you know, it's been a dream of mine for a long time to play alongside Christine as a, as a teammate at the club team, club level. So I'm really excited to, to build our connection that we've had for so many years on the national team and, and have Portland fans hopefully excited to see that. Right. Where do you see yourself fitting into position when we talk about she sees you? Yeah, I think there's a few different positions. Obviously, my preference is to be, you know, closer to the goal uh, and being able to influence influence attacks but at the end of the day I think my versatility is one of my best aspects so wherever she asks me to play I'm happy to you know do my best in that position and we'll see as training continues as games uh, come thick and fast where, where I end up. Like I said earlier, winning trophies, winning championships, uh, performing week in and week out. I think consistency has been something that I've struggled with in my club career, not so much on the national team. But uh, I also came to Portland because it's a place where I think I'll feel my value uh, and feel loved and hopefully by the fans and by the team. So, um, But I have full expectation that I need to come here and perform at the top of my game in order to help the team win a trophy, um, You know, to do things that personally I've, I've dreamt of doing. So yeah, like I said, I think it's the perfect storm of, of things here in Portland to help me build my career as an individual, but also uh, help the team. But specifically for me, what are some things in your coaching style that they click with you? Yeah, she's a, a big team culture, team value uh, kind of coach. Values having good team camaraderie, good people around. And I think that's one thing that I was really excited about to play underneath her. She's created a really great environment here. Um, and like I said, an environment that every, any player would be would be lucky to be in. So she's um, she's hard headed. She's she's tough, uh, tough coach in the, in the best way. 
um, expects a lot out of her players, but is also very, um, very kind-hearted in the way that she develops her players. And I think, like I said, she has high expectations for us um, and for myself, for sure, working with her for so many years and playing alongside of her. Uh, she knows what I can do, and, and I, I can't wait to play for her. I want to give her everything that she's hoping for. You mentioned how being in Portland was a dream for you. I mean, how is it just to be back in the U.S. in general? It's so nice to be home. I'm a short two-hour flight from my family, which is something that hasn't been a reality in a really long time for me, so I'm really excited about that. Um, yeah, it, I had a great time in, in Europe. It was great to experience a different culture, but I'm really excited to be back and, and kind of be coming home a little bit. So to play in the U.S., again, like I said, with the league coming as far as it has, I'm excited to join at a, at a big time in, in women's soccer in the U.S. with the World, coming up, World Cup coming up next season next year, I should say. Um, I'm excited to, you know, hit the ground running and, and try and bring another championship to Portland. Good? Perfect. I think we're good.